The lost child. Have you ever lost sight of your family in a busy place? Do you remember the apprehension you felt till you saw them again? Let us read this story to know the plight of a young boy who lost his parents in a village fair. The child entered the fair with his parents and watched in fascination at the world around him. The child's Gulab mouth jamun, watered rasgulla, as he stared barfi, at his favorite jalebi. sweet, the barfi. He knew his parents would not heed his plea and say he was greedy. The child moved on to the flower cellar and looked yearningly at a garland. However, he knew his parents would refuse him, saying the flowers were cheap. The child was then swayed by the rainbow colors of the balloons and wanted them. But he knew his parents will never buy him balloons, saying he was too old to play with them. The child was then attracted by the snake charmer's music and his snake. Knowing his parents had forbidden him from hearing such coarse music, he walked away. A roundabout in full swing that carried men, women and children in circles caught the child's attention. The child gathered courage to tell his parents that he wanted to go on the roundabout, but as he turned to look, neither of them were there. Filled with panic, the child wailed. He ran towards a shrine crowded with people, hoping to see his parents. A stranger heard his cry and picked him up. The stranger tried to soothe the child by luring him with the roundabout, the snake charmer, colorful balloons, garlands at the flower cellar, and sweets. The child only cried, I want my mother, I want my father. Upset over the absence of his parents, none of the material goods in the fair could make the child feel safe and secure. Just as the child in this story, we may hanker after many things that please our senses. Yet, our sense of security and comfort comes from the presence of our parents, our family.